There's a small town in Canada on the edge of the Arctic Circle where people and polar bears share the land. Welcome to Churchill, Manitoba, polar bear capital of the world, where the temperature is a beautiful minus 10 Celsius and it's only going to get colder. But just getting to Churchill is quite a feat in itself, especially when you've got a fear of flying like me. To get there, I flew from Albuquerque, where it's a pleasant 50 degrees Fahrenheit, but it's also five o'clock in the morning. To Denver, where it's 44 and foggy outside, but it's okay, I'm not going outside. And then Calgary, where it is freezing. I mean, below freezing. It is cold. Look. See that thing there? I'll be going up it in just a couple of minutes. <laughs> Glad to be inside. So I have got a couple of hours to kill. So I'm going to go on this Irish pub here. I'm going to get me some curry and chips. Wow, this is amazing. Mm. Really good. Oh my God, that was amazing. And it's snowing. I haven't seen snow in a long time. And finally, Winnipeg. And in case you can't see, it's snowing. And I love the snow. I really am like a kid in Santa's grotto, but did I mention that I love the snow? I might have forgot to mention it. Winnipeg! Snow! <laughs> I love it! Did I mention I love it? And that there is our plane. Hi. How are you? Good. Good. Somewhere, somewhere. 12A, come on in. Thank you. We're on the left hand side window seat. Thank you. And that was Carmere into Churchill and uh, lived up to his reputation. That was one of the calmest, smoothest flights I've ever been on. I'm impressed. Good job, Captain. I like you. You can fly me again. And welcome to Churchill where it's a chilly, I think it's here was minus seven. <laughs> it's definitely chilly, no snow. Come in the next day or two. You don't see this in Albuquerque, New Mexico. If you see a polar bear in town, call this number. Don't see that many places actually. Not in Manchester, not in Wales, not in Albuquerque, just here. And this people is Churchill, polar bear capital of the world. And they say be aware of your surroundings and honestly I have not stopped looking around it's it's kind of surreal but there could be a polar bear around any corner a little bit unnerving but it's kind of surreal and kind of awesome as well so it's almost 10 o'clock at night and the streets are deserted And that sound there that you hear, that is like an unofficial curfew. It's 10 o'clock. It means that the polar bear patrol are done for the night. And if you're out on the streets, you are on your own. I mean, literally, if you and a, if you and a polar bear, polar bear is probably gonna win. 
So right now, I'm gonna go inside. And there's something howling. I don't know what that is, but there's something howling on the other side of the road. I don't know if polar bears howl. Or if it was a wolf, but uh, I'm going inside. I'll see you tomorrow.